I'm recording? Yeah, I am. Welcome back, everyone. Now, let's get on to it, shall we? So, we are doing the Superlink Downshift slash Wheeljack. And John has a bit of a naming problem. This guy should have been Wheeljack, but he got Downshift. So, I'll go for the. This is. I can. This is the Japanese release of it. I don't believe there's anything different in paint scheme. Back in the early 2000s, there wasn't that much difference compared to this day and age. As you can see, I got. That's the Japanese defense, so I've got the all but one hidden. This is a very nice car mode. I wish I had a, an official, my official wheel jack, but he's in stores right now. Wheels roll. I think something's great. I'm more worried about the oil, but it's going to kind of rub off of me. The only thing I really don't like is the weapon placement. <laughs> it's just unnecessary. Let's get those off. Put your little energy on chip there if you want. If you have one spare, it's got a orbit symbol there that rolls around. So, yes, come on. I like seeing this is for my own John. We'll get to that gimmick later on. Transformation, these are early jobs, real easy. Right. Go for the dolls, and yeah, Sorry. open it. <laughs> That's nice, and they pretty much just rock down. Yep, like so. And follow the wheels back down. Flipping around and. This will work. <laughs> yeah, who cares? Unlatch the arms. Unpeg the legs. Put this flap open. Get the feet. Put them back. Click on the other side. Yeah, like so he can stand. Good balance doesn't fall over. I have another version of downshift of fun. Sure you go. I'll do his over here. Oh I forget. Take the spoiler off. I don't know why. Um peg the arms and fold them down. And put this back. And put these exhaust things down. And plug the chest area back in. And there we go. This is but I'm about to say cliff jump by, do It's not good. Cool. Wheeljack slash downshift. And I'm not sure I'm going yet, but this is the light piping. This has got some light piping in it, but. Probably just get it, but yes, nice good old red light piping. So yeah, this is kind of like my. This is actually my favorite deluxe mold from Angel Star Super League. I've got another one which is the Rodimus. It's not that good that one. He's in storage and stays in storage now. So, let me talk about the weapons for this guy firstly, because seriously, this is the weapons. What you're supposed to do is you're supposed to connect the weapons to the spoiler. So, you try not to launch the fucking thing. Like so, and it looks bad. Awesome. Because they've got the pegs on the side of the thing, because there's no hand in the peg. But yeah, there's a, that middle peg right there you can use to hold it. Like so. And this can fire. I'm trying to launch this thing, so. Yeah, it can launch. Okay, let's get pose ability, shall we? Head is ball jointed, which is. Bit limited going looking up, but they can go do side to side, which is easy. Arms on a hinge and a ball joint, so yeah. The elbow, just a straight 90 degree or so. No risk, cause no waste because of the gimmick of this line. Yep, in a really decent spread. Four in the back at the knee, so just below the knee, and no feet. Oh well, it's a really good rope point, honestly. If I had the other one out, it would show you. But, hey. You can't remember everything when you're doing reviews, okay? <laughs> now, the gimmick of the slime. Combining. Where one can either put shirts or pants. I'm going to show pants for me first. Which is the weakest form. 
push it all back up and just flip them back down out of the way like so that's bad you could oh you probably just flip his arm them all around and around like that it doesn't really help but that helps for when we're doing next mode which is the short mode which is generally why I put them in so you pretty much unhook the crotch and step down and get the new chest section there. Put the arms out of your wand. I just generally put them like Ooh, looks much better that way. Now for the new arms, <laughs> show it there, and you see a fist right there. Fold the feet up. Jesus, that's loud. Put that up, that, and. There you go, there's his shirt mode, and honestly, it's really good. There's one for the pants mode I want to get, which is Inferno, because he actually is legit decent as a pants mode. Because for this line, there's some that are made to be pants and made to be shirts. This guy's made to be a shirt. Inferno was made to be pants, because he looks honestly like a good set of pants. <laughs> you can bring the weapon back in and plug it in. So, I still don't like the weapon. <laughs> well, if you're feeling weird, there's ports right on these things here, right there. And I'll we'll just pick it in. Safe storage option. And you don't want to use them as weapons. Oh, geez. <laughs> Trying to drop them, that's the question. You never think anything, never, anything never wants to work on camera, honestly. And for the spoil, just put it back on the flap, like so. So yeah, I would recommend getting either this guy, the Japanese, if one if you have a good price, I legit had to pay like 150 for this. Yeah. I have a price at the time, but I needed him. I got also an eye eye. He's in storage as well. Anyway, I work on getting him good decent price and getting Inferno so you can do the whole pants shirt combination thing. So, I'll see you all next time. Bye.